French teachers who find themselves at breaking point after years of being asked to do more with less took to the streets of Paris, Lyon, Nice and Bordeaux on Saturday, demanding a salary increase and better conditions for teachers and students. Here's a summary of the article. French teachers who find themselves at breaking point after years of being asked to do more with less took to the streets of Paris, Lyon, Nice and Bordeaux on Saturday, demanding a salary increase and better conditions for teachers and students. In December, school teachers, administrators and other members of the national education system united to form the Stylos Rouges movement with the aim of bringing the struggles of France's teachers into the public eye. Among the demands are an immediate pay rise that would finally reflect decades of inflation as well as better conditions for both teachers and students, who sometimes struggle to excel in overcrowded classrooms staffed by teachers who are overstretched. An OECD study found that the salaries of teachers in France declined by about 10% between 2000 and 2015. The Stylos Rouges point out that new teachers working full-time can earn a gross salary of less than €1,900. Dominique Dubarry, an earth science professor in southern Paris and a member of the Stylos Rouges, told Europe One that the poor conditions teachers work under is also making recruitment harder. I'm the third generation of teachers in my family, and none of my kids wants to be a teacher. They have seen me all too often with the papers that follow me everywhere, the classes I must prepare, the all-nighters, she said. This post received a score of 47,158, with an upvote ratio of 91%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Not a world of difference in the UK and US. Other places too probably. Why is one of the most important professions so routinely undervalued? I really don't understand why people go into teaching in those circumstances. I'm just grateful they do. Lots of responses and not many from teachers, so I'll throw in my hat. Wheel, long story short, I fell in love with teaching. I am a teacher because my students deserve to graduate from high school as happy, healthy humans. For those who are talking about teachers who impacted their lives, reach out and tell them that. This makes me want to hug all of my teachers. I've been lucky to have great teachers, and all of your students are lucky to have you as theirs. Seriously, shooting them an email will totally make their day. If you can find them, they would love a note from you. Without their support my life could have easily gone down a very different path. I try to give back to my community just as my teachers taught me through their own actions. Thank you for being an empathetic, caring and supportive teacher. You probably already recognize this but it needs repeating. I have one former teacher on FB. He was my French teacher for four years. He told me year one, Dutch I can't teach you any French the best French teacher in the world couldn't teach you. On the end of my fourth year he said, you know what I believe you are the only student who never legitimately passed a test or worksheet. He let me use his class like it was a free block and I would do homework or leave the school and get stoned. Our deal starting the third year was I was allowed to take his class and fulfill the seating requirements for the higher year classes. I think that's a very unusual relationship. He was a kind of grumpy dry humored guy that would tell you the negative blunt and not have it sound nice. He was also a very nice guy and had lots of cool stories, so I'd get baked before class and just talk about random shit. Also he had cooking days where we would make crepes and bacon. I was very good at making crepes, pancakes and bacon, would drown the class in them on the baking days. Sounds like he was getting stoned a lot too. Seeing his retirement photos, I'm pretty sure he's been smoking for ages. Legit learned no French but he was one of my favorite teachers at a time when I was basically an ass to all teachers law. Thought about going into teaching as I have a master's, professional license, and lots of industry, real world, experience. I also absolutely love to teach, and have a lot of on-the-job teaching experience. Took a serious look into it and knocked right out. I can see the allure if you have an otherwise difficult to market degree, but I make so much more dollar dollar without all the political crap that I cannot rationalize doing it. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.